to the Harley dealership. Dude, wouldn't think I would see one of these. But like, where are you going to charge your Tycan at? Interesting, though, that they have a Tycan here already. Really good Porsche product. That's my favorite product of the year that came out from them. Very surprising to see it here. Like, where are you going to charge a, a Tycan at? And then you've got the SUVs, of course. I wonder how much it costs that person to get a Tycan here. I bet you over a million. If not more. So, yeah. Now let's go to the Harley. I figured I'd throw that in beforehand. And let's see how much a Harley Davidson costs in Vietnam. I actually want to know. Many people have asked me to come here and film. So you know what I'm doing? I'm giving the people what they want. So, booyah. Here we go. I mean, it's an impressive fucking building. It's huge. The front's jolly. Got some Harley mechanics out here. Oh, they got a bunch of them. right out front here. Let's see what they got got up in here. Service. Let's see. Where's the show floor? I don't know shit about Harleys. I've never been in the Harleys. Let's just look what's what's here. Service. Oh, lots of people getting shit service. Surprise. Oh, they got a bunch of Harleys. <clears throat> Again, I know nothing about Harleys. Xin Chao. 769. Oh. Hi, how much is this? Uh, yes, this price is. Where's the total price? Yes. So 779 million. Yes. Okay. Uh, not include uh, registration. Gotcha, gotcha. Come on. I'm just gonna look around and shoot a YouTube video. Yeah? Okay. Okay. Bong, bong. Come in. So for this one, it is 416 million. I'll have to convert all these prices. This one, 420. Remember, my bike only costs 89. This is 1200 cc. So that's a pretty big bike. Yeah, I've always just been a sports bike guy. I mean, I have no hate towards Harley. I just never, this would be a nice little bobber, but right around 479. So, I think it's some hotties working here. <clears throat> We're going over all the prices, people. They can get all the accessories and stuff. Okay, 509 with a red color. This one has listed 479. 1200 330 for this guy I, Again, I don't know. I can't tell you too much because I've never been in the Harley This one's 386 is sitting Sold, these are all sold This one was 509 in the red Let's see. This is an 883 and this one was 356. This one's sold, so they pulled the thing off of it. This one is 478 for a 1200. I mean, I don't know where you would drive these at. There's nowhere to go fast in Vietnam. Oh, this thing looks like a beast. Let's see how much this big beast is. Wow, well, 799. Almost a billion. This guy is 489. I don't know what it is. 1200. Big CC, so. This one looks like a big, big old girl, too. 114 cubic inch. It's pretty big. This one is 799. 799. This is 710 for the fat boy. I know that this is a fat boy without the tag because my girlfriend, one of my girlfriends had. Her dad had one of them. 520 for a street bob. 2019. So Heritage Classic, which is what this is, is 809. 
These are not cheap. <clears throat> Let's see. Nine. What is this thing? It's so expensive. The Road King. So a Road King costs. This one, as we're seeing it, is nine nineteen. Oh no, eight ninety nine. This is the Heritage Classic as well. This one's used, and this one's going for seven hundred. So you, you save a whopping two hundred. What do we got over here? Some bobber. Five hundred and ninety for that. If you want to ride that really uncomfortable bike. I think we've got the pricing down. I got a stretcher out though. We got to take more look around. You can get a nice little Harley helmet. 2.6 million for a bell dog. This stuff's not cheap. Oh, it sucks it says Harley all over it. They got proper size jackets it looks like too for big boys. They must have really trying to break into the marketplace here. More clothing, street girl clothing. What accessories can you buy? It's like an intake, louder exhaust. Let's see, which one would I actually ride? I wouldn't ride that huge thing. I would want something small for this Saigon traffic. Let's look at the accessories. Clutch cover. Oh, you can put a, a bigger lobe camshaft in. That's kind of cool. Put it like a cold air intake kind of thing. I like the cam swap. The exhaust, Screaming Eagle. Uh, this must be Harley's performance line, I'm guessing. I don't know. I think, as I've said a million times, I know nothing about Harley. Handlebars. Oh, they have their own oil. Is it as shitty as Yamalub? So I mean, there, there you go, you know, if you want a Harley and you've got around 40, 50 grand to spend, this seems to be the cheapest, it's 330. I think that's the cheapest one. And that's 882, 883. I think this is gonna be your cheapest option at a Harley, besides for like secondhand. This is a super low 2020, 300, 4,000, 8,000, that's not bad. It's 12,000, pretty sure. Let me calculate one of these out real quick. 420, what is this? Let me calculate this. I don't think they're quite as expensive as what, what we were told. Hold on, 420. I think that's gonna be around before I calculate four, eight, 12, 16, 16 grand ish. So, I mean, that's like, isn't that what these things cost back? I don't know anything about Harley. Eighteen thousand. So that's eighteen thousand. Interesting. What's what's this? This one's 386, but in the spec it's 416, so same price, 18,000. So the cheapest you can get into a Harley for, let's see, that one was 330. 330, $14,234. Not including um, registration, she said, but that's super cheap. You probably just do that on your own. Interesting. Um, which Harley would I pick? Hmm. Honestly, none of them. I don't like Harleys. Seems a bit expensive for me. But I guess maybe like this. I don't even know what size engine this has. Probably the smallest one. Because <laughs> you don't want all that weight. This is an Iron 883. That kind of looks the nicest too. Less is more. It's still just too heavy of a bike for for, in my opinion, for Saigon. All right, guys, so that was the Harley-Davidson tour. I priced you out every bike, so enjoy. If you're looking to get a Harley, you can get one. Peace.